In this lecture, we are going to talk about control of heart activity by the, by the vasomotor center. How the vasomotor center plays it its role in controlling the heart activity. When there is a need to increase the heart activity or when there is a need to decrease the heart activity, the vasomotor center plays its role. Previously, we discussed that the vasomotor center basically it is present at the level of medulla and pons and in the upper part of the medulla there is uh, in the vasomotor center there are vasoconstrictor areas and in the lower part of the parts of the medulla there are vasodilator areas of the vasomotor center. In these areas, the vasoconstrictor areas and the vasodilator areas of the vasomotor center basically plays a role in vasoconstriction and vasodilation. Vasoconstriction and vasodilation of blood vessels. But apart from the blood vessels, this vasomotor center is also playing its role in increasing and decreasing the activity of the heart. Whenever there is a need to increase the heart rate, when there is a need to, in, for example, the BP is going down or there is a, a sympathetic response, like there is a fear or fight or flight response, then the lateral portions of the vasomotor center, the lateral portion, the, the portions, uh, the sides of the vasomotor center, uh, centers on the lateral sides, they basically increase the heart rate with the help of sympathetic nerves. Nerves. When there is a need to decrease the heart rate, for example, the heart rate is high or, or there is some, some other need to decrease the heart rate, then the medial portions of the vasomotor center, this is basically vasomotor center and it has been shown from the front and this is also basically vasomotor center and it is present at the level of the uh, medulla and pons. So, the when the there is need to increase the heart rate the simp it increases the heart rate with the help of sympathetic nerves and that uh, increase in the heart rate is with the help of the lateral parts of the vasomotor center when there is a need to decrease the heart rate then the medial part the medial portion of the uh, vasomotor center it sends signals with the help of nucleus of vagus nerve it sends signals to the nucleus of vagus nerve, vagus nerve and then those signals uh, go through the vagus nerve through the uh, to the heart and it causes a decrease in heart rate with the help of parasympathetic nerve so there are two responses sympathetic response and parasympathetic response the sympathetic response causes increase in heart rate with the help of sympathetic nerves and the parasympathetic response causes decrease in heart rate with the help of vagus nerve and that signal through the vagus nerves comes through the nucleus of the vagus nerve which is present in the near the vasomotor center. So vasomotor center is not only playing its role in controlling the vasoconstriction and vasodilation of the blood vessel, it is not playing its role only in controlling the circulation or the blood vessel tone but it is also playing its role in increasing and decreasing the activity of the heart. So that's all about the control of heart activity by the vasomotor center that how it is playing its role in increasing and decreasing